Hi there, I'm Courtney. This is Solavi Holistic, and you're watching another two-minute meditation. I talk a lot, uh, particularly with clients, about the aspects of themselves that they struggle with. Personality traits, ways of being, old wounds, habits, it's these things about themselves that just cause a lot of distress. And one of the things that I try to, to share is an invitation to just kind of approach that with some level of neutrality. And an example from my own life that I frequently will use to try to make this uh, make sense is, you know, that I'm really sensitive. And for a, a lot of my life, I heard things like, you're too sensitive. Why are you so sensitive? Why can't you toughen up? Why don't you have a thicker skin? And so I started to feel like that part of myself was somehow wrong or bad. And as I moved into adulthood and found my occupation and found a, a calling that felt very natural, I, I came to understand that my sensitivity was actually an asset. And part of being able to embrace that was by recognizing it as both good and bad. There are things that my sensitivity causes me pain and grief, and then there's things that it makes me really uh, good at. It makes me a, a, a good clinician. It makes me a good friend. And so um, I offer that today as a way of just approaching things that maybe you're struggling with within your own self. And so we're going to meditate today, just a, a brief meditation, thinking about the compassionate ways that you can encounter all of who you are, your whole self, all of the things, and being able to approach them with just a neutrality. I am a sensitive person. That's it. Right? There's no, there's no qualifiers to that. There's no quantifiers. There's no conditions. It just is a thing that is, and it's just the way that I move through the world. And so we're going to just sit together for a couple minutes, closing our eyes, coming together in the breath, and just sitting with that idea of non-judgment, of accepting the things that are as they are. Neither good nor bad, both good and difficult. Assets and challenges, both and all and everything. And when you feel those self-judgments arising, when you hear that inner critic complaining about who you are, come back to this moment and try to approach that voice with compassion and with love and work to reframe those words to something more neutral something less harsh, something less judgmental. When you feel ready, you can open your eyes. Thanks for practicing with me today. I'll see you next time.